Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is still Thursday, June 17th, 2021, on the Drunk Folk Group Tis Beer Time. So, let me talk to you about something. First beer of the day is great, especially when you had a long day at work. Maybe that's a great beer. But I'm going to argue that the best beer of the day is the second beer of the day. Why? Well, because it means you're having a second beer. Perhaps with the promise of more beers to come. But is there anything better than a two-beer buzz on a sunny afternoon? Like, is there? Is that second pint? You're not hammered. You're not drunk. You're nothing of the sort. But you kind of have let the troubles of the world and the weight of that world off of your shoulders, and you are like, I am happy. I will have another beer. So from my friend, the Beer Santa. Dropped off a whole 12-pack of beer from Radical Road in Toronto. Comes with 8-track IPA, 6.5%. I feel like it leans West Coast. I'm sure I've had this many, many times ago. But he dropped off, too, because, you know, beers, beers, beers. The second beer of the day, man. Oh, let me tell you something. A lot of days I only have one. And those are nice days. It's nice to have a beer when you come home from work and you got to work the next day. Beautiful to sit outside and have a pint, read the book for a little while, maybe talk to your significant other, watch the sun set, clouds go by, but getting that second beer, oh, smells piney, a little bit of peach in there, let's go, cheers my friends to beer friends, beer saint moments, it's nice to see them, let's go, cheers. Definitely, definitely getting some peach up front, um, grapefruit, a little bit of orange pith, and then a big old piney back end. Piney back end sounds like dirtier than it should, <laughs> but still, um, wow. That's that's a good West Coast. That's the funny part with these West Coast IPAs is that they're very, as they say, they're very different from each other, but they are. They all have that same kind of resinous pine, pithy, you know, they got to be bitter, they got to be bold, they want to have like a nice malty in the background, but you know, they're different because they reuse different hops and different processes, not processes, but you know what I mean, different hop additions when they're adding them in, the malt bill changes, um, that's nice, it's, it's old school, like so if you're looking for an old school West Coast style IPA, this is what you're looking for, pithy, piney, bitter, it's refreshing though too, second beer of the day. Now, by no means is that my last beer of the day. However, I do have to work tomorrow, so there won't be like, you know, last night where there was, I don't know, a couple, three beers, six, eight beers, you're going to have eight beers, ten beers, tell people you have twelve beers, whatever. Um, but yeah, it's okay to have a couple beers. And a couple beers, well, it's just a good feeling. And if you can have them with friends, oh, patios are open. If you can go and sit at a patio, check out Radical Road. It's just, it's there. So thank you again to my beer saying, appreciate it a lot, and uh, enjoyed. It's being enjoyed. Second beer of the day. A lot of love for you guys. Cheers. Have a good one. Eight tracks. You know, sadly enough, I remember eight tracks because I'm old poke sometimes. Old pokey.